How's it going, YouTube? Chris here, my home theater. Got a brand new video for you this afternoon. I know it's been a little while since I've posted anything. I've uh, just been trying to get things together. Uh, I know the original closing date for this house was on the 1st. As you can see, I'm still in my theater and it's still put together. Uh, now, we've we bounced, uh, the buyers have bounced the date around quite a few times from the 20th to the 23rd to the 17th to the 20th to the 23rd to the 17th. Uh, but it's set in stone now. It's gonna be closing on the 17th and that is uh, roughly nine days from now. So once we get closed on the 17th, I will be, well, I'm gonna start the weekend prior. So probably gonna tear this theater down and get everything moved out. Now I did give the buyer, the option to buy this stuff. And when he asked me how much it would take to leave it here, and when I told him, uh, I thought he was gonna have a heart attack. But, you know, I can't replace it even for what I told him. It was a pretty substantial amount. And uh, you guys know what my equipment is. And I, I, I just, I can't replace it for that amount of money. So uh, he didn't want it. So it's a good thing I'm gonna take it with me. So all this stuff will go with me. The only thing I'm leaving is the screen, uh, but I'm taking my actuators and everything else. So now, with that being said, my new house, I don't have room inside the house for a theater. It is a four bedroom, three bathroom house, it's about 1,700 and something square feet, it's brick, uh, has a new metal roof, new HVAC. So it's, it's a pr pretty nice house and it's, it's perfect for for me and uh, my three kids. But with that being said, also it has two lots. It's got a pretty good size lot that the house sits on. It's got a big lot in the back that's totally fenced in. But here's the good thing. It has a block building in the back that her grandfather or uncle or who it was built. It is a two car garage. And I was over there just yesterday I needed to get some measurements so I can kind of plan on some things to, so I can start planning on building my new theater because that's where my theater is going to be. And on the outside, it's 30 foot long and 20 foot wide. So it's the theater that I'm going to build is going to be roughly uh, maybe a little bit longer than what I have now. Uh, this room. This room that I'm in now is 15 and a half foot wide or 15 foot, three inches wide. And it, it started out being 27 foot long, but ended up being 24 and has 10 and a half foot ceilings. Now my, my new room, uh, I need to measure that. I didn't go inside and measure. So I'm thinking this probably got like eight foot ceilings. So regardless, uh, the room will be bigger. It may not have as tall a ceiling, which is, yeah, I'm fine with that. Uh, but whole one end of it will be the screen. So I'm going to have, I'm going to put the biggest screen that I can afford to put in there. So whether it be 200, 250, 300, I don't know. I, I'll have to uh, do the measurements and figure it out when I get in there. And I'm going to have that screen where it lifts up just like the one I got now. Uh, but I'm really excited about that. It'll be uh, away from the house, and uh, I just I just got big plans. I don't want to say too much now because I need to get in there and take measurements and then draw it out and uh, just kind of map out exactly how I want to do it. Uh, but it's going to be good, and I will have a. I'm going to build what's called a lean to off the front of the building, and that'll be my entrance so i'll have a bar i'll have a ticket booth i'm gonna have uh, video games I'm gonna, I'm gonna have all kinds of stuff and there's stuff that i couldn't have in this theater so even though it was a bad situation you know with a divorce having to sell the house having to move uh losing this theater that i've been wanting for 30 years uh i think it's going to end up being even better because i posted a video uh, if you go back and look and look and look at all my videos, uh, things that I would do differently if I had it to do over again, well, I got it to do over again and there's going to be a lot of things different. So I'm really excited to be able to do that. 
and I'm going when I when I build this room, I'm going to build it pretty much future proof. Uh, I'm already going to install. Uh, I'm probably going to install eight Atmos speakers. I'm going to pre-wire the walls for uh, more floor speakers, uh, surround speakers. I mean, I'm going I'm going to future proof this room. So as I able to upgrade my processors, it's just a matter of hooking speakers up. I won't have to run any wires. Everything will be done. Well, the Atmos speakers will already be there. So really excited of what's to come. Uh, this <laughs> this upcoming project in the new house, uh, it won't be like this room. It only took me five weeks to build, and then I had to wait on my carpet. It, it, this is probably going to take me a while because... Uh, like I say, I got I got big plans on how I want to do it, so just just it's gonna take me a while. But I'm gonna be posting videos, kind of like I did when I when I built this room. I posted, you know, every day or that I got done that I worked, and you know, just kind of posted an update on it. And and I hope you guys will follow along, and I hope this brings more subscribers and and. Uh, and I just just hope just hope everybody enjoys it as much as I'm going to enjoy it. So I just wanted to give everybody an update because I hadn't seen everybody in a while. Uh, just still just a lot going on. Just trying to deal with this stuff. And I'm gonna be like I said, I'm gonna be packing. I'm probably gonna shoot a video in here in this room when I tear it down. Just kind of do a, you know, you guys saw me put it together. Now you're gonna see me tear it apart. And uh, I know it's, it's kind of a sad day, but I, I, I think in the end it's gonna be it's gonna be even better. So, uh, guys, y'all tune in next week, next weekend, and uh, we'll probably shoot that other video. And then I'm telling you something, there's better things to come. Real excited about it. So everybody, stay tuned, and everybody have a good week coming up. And we'll see you again real soon.